Texas has a lot of amazing things to offer. A diverse art scene, various lovely parks to satisfy the outdoorsy types, man-eating recluses, lively clubs and streets dedicated to partying. I got you, didn't I? Surely you've seen Hooper's 70s classic, Texas Chainsaw Massacre. What if I told you there was a locale dedicated to fans of the franchise in the state? I might think you'd say, no duh dude, it's Texas Chainsaw, not Maryland Chainsaw. Which, yeah, but this place is for fans, not some displaced location with no way of seeing it for yourself, like the actual ranch house, which is privately owned and, just like the real film, doesn't take too kindly to strangers living on their property. This is where the gas station comes in. Located in Bass Strip, Texas, this seemingly normal gas station may look familiar to some horror buffs. Many find themselves at the same station that sealed the fates of the teens from the original movies. Only now you won't find any cannibalistic southerners, rather some friendly faces, and totally not human barbecue that hits the spot, and maybe occasionally Jason Voorhees, but we'll get to that in a second. Roy Rose, an Ohio businessman, purchased the station, added food, lodging, and a replica of the film's green vintage van, and opened doors in 2016. Yes, you heard me, lodging. You can rent one of four unassuming cabins out here in the foresty wilds of Bastrop and experience the night for yourself. If the cabins are too clean for your taste, the station also has campsite spots for you and your family. When in Texas, one of the best foods to try is definitely authentic Texas barbecue, and Rose knows this. His menu over at the station has brisket, pulled pork, and sausage, all human-free, I assure you, with classic sides like coleslaw and potato salad available for you as well. The pricing is extremely fair, which makes this place a good destination for hungry people not looking to eat another hungry person. <laughs> While this touristy stuff sounds good and well, what's to offer for horror fans? Well, luckily there's plenty for y'all too. The station holds events on site with popular actors quite frequently and is a guest at the cult classic convention held in Texas every year. Memorabilia and merchandise is available in the station itself as well, offering goodies like autographs from the main star of Texas Chainsaw 2, Carolyn Williams, or actual pieces of the station obtained from renovation with certificate of authenticity. You might even witness a crossover or two when Rose's business partner stops by. Rose does indeed have a famous name tacked to his business in the weirdest way. It's not his famous visitors or esteemed guests, but his business partner and good friend Ari. For those who don't recognize the name, Ari Lehman is known mostly for his role as the original Jason Voorhees in the Friday the 13th films. There might be a joke that starts off with something like this, I don't know. Jason versus Leatherface anyone? I'm down. With all that aside, whether you like barbecue, horror, camping, or an absurd combination of all three, the station is definitely a top-tier visitor destination here in Texas. Just avoid hitching a ride with that green van, and be sure to dial up the station at 512-321-SAWS. See you soon!